my god did you hear there are fleets there's fleets well Twitter has stories so if you're wondering what Twitter stories are what Twitter fleets are well, I'm going to talk about that show you what you can do with them what you can't do with them how do they compare to the other story platforms and what's it all about so November 17th Twitter announced fleets so I don't know if they're available everywhere but they're available in my account I'm going to show you kind of how that works we're going to do that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets all right so Twitter finally came around and created stories now we have stories everywhere the only place I can't post stories to is YouTube because I don't have enough subscribers but I'm posting stories everywhere and I'm going to start posting them in fleets as well in Twitter stories so we're going to show you how that works and the differences and but by the way before we get any further if you're listening to the audio of this or the shorter version you might want to go to cis270.jsgagnon dot com to go check out the longer video and the video itself if you're listening to audio so you can actually see what I'm talking about here right because I'm I'm going to show you screen captures and screenshots or my screen my phone screen and all that so let's get right to it so let's go over here so first of all as you can see uh there's my phone screen but this is this let's just move that a little bit out of the way here because we don't really need it right now so in LinkedIn and Twitter there are stories but they're not showing up on the news feed right so you only don't see them on the desktop uh you're going to see the stories on the desktop in Instagram and you also see them on Facebook but let's get back to Twitter so if you want to see stories on Twitter you need to uh, let's just move that down here so you go into your Twitter app obviously and then uh if I go back to my to the home you'll see at the top there there are stories right so you can see all these stories you can actually watch all these and um, I'm not sure they they do have issues I did post a story before and it's not showing up anymore but I did find a way to go find it and show you so there's somebody that actually reacted to my story and it's right here so this is exactly what it would look like down the bottom you can see that there's um there's some uh there's the list of people that saw it right so you can actually kind of scroll up and see who saw your story right and in the list you can actually see people that you're following and people that are following you right so people that I'm following uh they'll see my story but they might not be following me right so this person here that I'm following this person here is that I'm following but they're not following me except these ones see these ones are following each other and if you find uh, you can actually see through the list here people that you can follow it'll show right here follow right instead of following if they're not follow if you're not following following them yet so you can actually discover who's been watching your stories or your fleets right so these are fleets and if I if I tap on the left or on the right right it's kind of lets you go forward or back oops now it's gone so now my fleet is gone my story is gone um I'm not sure if I can I guess I can still go to it for now but if I keep going here I can see the rest of the fleets that I posted right and I can see that only like the last one only seven people saw it right and but the thing is that this was posted 19 hours ago so it should be in my list at the top it should be showing up at the top but it's not so I guess there's still some kinks to work out because if I go back up here as you can see there's no there's no I don't have any but if I post a new fleet so here's the thing with the fleets you can post text which is just like a tweet right a text tweet you can post a picture or a video from your phone you can capture a picture right I can just do a picture right like this and now I can post that as a fleet or discard or I can record a video just like other platforms if I flip the camera around over here right I can have this like this and we're going to post a little fleet right now to kind of show you how it works so you can either press and let go of the big red button like that to record start recording it'll record until you either press it again or until it it's, uh, reaches the maximum which I, I believe is 20 seconds but let's do it right now so let's just do that right now hey so I'm doing a training right now on what are fleets so you can go check it out at cis270.jsgagnon.com 
I mean you can go there it's not going to be there right right now but it should be there by the time you see this fleet so cis 270.jsgagnon.com I'm going to post some more in, in here with the, the link right in the text so you can see what it is hey, so now doing a training. turn my volume up so now you see I have the well you can see it there on the screen right it's playing uh you can tap this to remove the sound if you want off of your the the you know this this thing down the bottom here you can tap that to remove the sound if you don't want the sound in your in your story and your fleet and then when you're ready you just tap the fleet button right there so there you go so that's going to post it to your you know story in your fleets and let's just go see if it actually added it yeah so see now I'm seeing my I'm seeing my face right there and by the way I think earlier there was a it was red so I'm assuming that there was an error posting and when I tried to go look at it it kind of erased all my well they didn't erase them they're still there but they weren't showing in the list here right if I tap it now I see the one that I just posted 15 seconds ago right which is the video we just did just now together right okay so I'm not sure about the rest they're probably there someplace maybe some other people can see them but maybe I can't right now but that's not the point now so if I click on add let's say I put a text right here so the episode will be at cis 270.jsgagnon.com right jsgagnon.com links are shortened automatically oh so they actually let you put links oh that's very cool I'm going to see if that works then you can uh, you can also make this a uh, color if you want and I can move it around right I can add some more oh I can make the whole background oh look at that that uh, that's new I didn't even know about that you tap this little thing it changed the background color of it right now I can add some more text though I can say um see you there see you there and I'm going to make this red and bold with a background there you go right so I'm going to fleet that I'm going to add that to my fleet so I don't know it looks like maybe I could even have that linkable so let's go see what happens if I go to my fleets can I tap that no it doesn't let you tap it I don't know what it why it said something about your maybe the account depending on the account uh it lets you do it I don't know we'll find out later but anyways that's the fleet the other thing you can do and by the way let's go through my whole process of posting of syndicating stories because you know you could record stories in different platforms I, I could record my fleet right here but as you can tell like see for example if I have as you I don't know if you noticed this but when I did the recording of that video I couldn't add any text or anything to it now they're saying they're going to improve the features eventually over time but for now right now you can't do any of that you can do it on a picture if I put a picture I think so anyways capture let's flip it around and do a picture <laughs> yeah okay I can put text on this hey there right I can put text on it make it bold make it uh, color different colors whatever I want right whoops done uh, I can I don't know if I can can I resize yeah I can make it bigger there you go I can resize it by flick flicking right making the screen and move it around and all that just like uh, most of the other platforms can do that right um this is fun this is fun and then let's make this uh, I don't know let's make it this or this there we go there you go uh, let's just do that like that right whatever and I'm going to post that fleet there you go so now I've got three fleets added for today on my that I added directly from here right so now the what I'm going to be doing is syndicating my stories across all the platforms right you can't see the whole the whole thing right here right but yeah so that's what I'm going to be doing so now how do I do that so the way that I do my uh recording of stories hopefully my computer is going to not give me a, a problem because earlier it, it crashed I was doing this before but so I go in snapchat and I I the thing about snapchat is I can actually add 
these crazy effects and there's lots of them on snapchat and you can record 60 seconds a full video of 60 seconds before you um before you uh it, it keeps wanting to re to move my 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 thing here right so let's just make it the full so you can see the whole thing uh whoops it's not the whole thing right there what's going on is that not oh there we go okay so yeah so I mean the record the the snapchat lets me do a 60 second a whole 60 second and then I can share it. and we'll show you what I mean by that so let's just do it right now I'm actually going to do my episode my story post for the day's episode because the day's episode right is all about fleets course income secrets 270 what are fleets twitter stories how to use twitter fleets so let's just go for it right now hey how's it going I'm having fun here with this filter I'm actually doing right now I'm actually doing an episode on fleets on twitter fleets I know this is snapchat or at least the recording is started in snapchat that's because I do syndication from all the stories I actually record on snapchat it gives me a lot it gives me the ability to do these crazy effects and record up to 60 seconds and then I share it to Instagram which will automatically split it for me into four 15 second videos which then I can share those 15 second videos to to Facebook and LinkedIn and Twitter so I'm going to be doing that and showing you how to do that if you want to go and find out about Twitter fleets and see how I syndicate my content across all the platforms go to cis270.jsgagnon.com that's cis270.js g-a-g-n-o-n.com see you there okay so now I've got my recorded video and I save it so uh let's just take that out of there so you see down the bottom on the whoops right over here you see down the bottom on the snapshot there's this little down arrow so you tap that and that saves it to your phone right so it'll save it to the phone and after it's saved on the phone then I make changes to it for snapchat specifically for snapchat so that's what I do I share it to my snapchat story but now I have a 60 second video that's recorded with maybe some weird effects or maybe other things depending on what I'm trying to do that day depends on the day but I do this I add my snap code to it I also add the text which is the the description of the actual story right I put that up on top usually and then I add a uh, uh, swipe up because in snapchat I can actually put the link right so I can swipe up to watch video and read blog now if I had I think on the, on instagram you got to have 10,000 followers to add links or to swipe up links or maybe not I don't know maybe it's changed now but I only have like 4,500 or so followers on on instagram and on facebook I'm not sure if there's any uh, option for links but okay so we have this link over here which is there we put that down at the bottom and I put a cute little up arrow there to kind of say go and swipe up right so then I post that which I post to my story and to spotlight and either way that's why I add my own snap code because if somebody sees my snap in the spotlight which is based on where you live right well they wouldn't know who I am they, it doesn't let you see who the person is right so if you put your snap code and they decide to share it people will be able to do a screenshot and follow you if they want right so now I'm posting to snapchat then I leave that I go into instagram and I share to instagram right over here I just go to uh, the camera plus now they changed it by the way that used to be that you would press uh, the little there would be actually a little plus with the story right but now they change it they moved it up there and you just got to say story and then you upload I'm going to upload this video right here and in my snap in my Instagram as you can see down the bottom here right we got four pieces of content right so we got four pieces of content down here it's splitting the 60 second video into four videos for me so I don't have to use an editing software or anything like that that's kind of cool that's one of the reasons that I like it so in here I usually talk about something about the day in the first two and then in the last two I actually post the episode and the link right so I'm just going to say over here uh having fun learning about fleets okay I'm just going to do that do that and then I'm going to put that in here have you 
heard have you heard about twitter stories there we go let's do that let's do another color and then I'm just going to put the episode title right here and there we go like this and do the same thing on this page I have a whole process I actually did another episode on this specifically but anyways I, I'm just going through to kind of show you how we end up on Twitter right and uh, so over here I say learn more learn more at cis zero gagnon.com all right then I'm going to just copy all this copy and make it blue that's what I always do and then I go over here I paste that here I make that blue again but dark blue and then I say next share to my story and done okay so now I've posted to my story and um and on Instagram so it's posting on Instagram I can actually see right here what's going on uh, as you can see I don't get a ton of views on Instagram I used to get like it's totally crazy I used to get like two three hundred views on my stories and then from one day to the next it got it went down to just a few right less than 10 I'm not even getting 10 views right <coughs> I'm not really sure what it is but some some are saying it's just because Instagram is now a lot more of ads right it's a lot more people they're they're gonna show if you pay for it right so uh, I guess that makes sense from a business perspective for them right so while that's happening I gotta wait for the story to finish uploading on Instagram because it's when it uploads that it saves it to your phone so it becomes a, I it becomes a file that's on your um, gallery as well right so that you can then, then use to upload to Facebook LinkedIn and Twitter so now it's almost done it's already finishing up so the cool thing about that is that you don't have to figure out how to split it into 20 second pieces like you know if it's a 60 second video you could split it into three 20 second videos if you wanted right you could use software on your computer to do that or you could um, and then and with the three 20 second videos you can actually share that on Facebook on LinkedIn and on Twitter but <coughs> but you wouldn't be able to do it on on Instagram because it's 15 second pieces right or at least you would but then you'd end up with one 15 second piece a five second piece then another 15 and another five another 15 and another five right so I mean that's kind of what it would do on Instagram so now it's finished so now I just go out to Facebook I click on the little create a story and I just add them in the right sequence I had this one here the first one right then I add the second one and then I add the third one and then I add the fourth one so now I've got my four stories of videos posting on to um, uh, Facebook then I can do the LinkedIn ones now the LinkedIn ones I actually have to wait so I gotta upload one so I go into here I upload it right here number one and I actually have to wait for it to upload because if I found that if I try to upload the four of them right away just like I did on Facebook there one after the other if one of them <coughs> if one of them fails to upload properly it'll end up screwing up the sequence and not posting it right next to the other one right it'll end up posting it as a uh, in the wrong sequence so as soon as it says finishing up I can start posting the next one so I go to there I go fin find number two and I post that and then again the same thing right you see preparing to upload right here eventually it says uploading and one once the once this starts going up you'll see it in a second here it'll start going up and yeah, maybe hopefully it'll do it come on let's go uploading let's go let's go no it's not even getting there I'll go back and then I'll, there you go uploading 45 48 70 80 and when it's when it's at the finishing up once it's at finishing up then I can upload the next one I just say new story I add the third one and then I wait for that third one too but that's the last one now, as you notice I'm tapping on the right and on the left of the screen to go back and forth right that's kind of how you do it on uh, all the story platforms are all the same Twitter is no different the fleets are the same they'll let you go forward and backwards like that 
but as you can see right here let's just finish it up okay last one let's do the last one right here okay so now we have the four videos on on LinkedIn as well right that that was yesterday's whoops sorry wrong one so over here that was yesterday's right these these first four well what's going on why is it exiting I must be tapping too low so the first four right here right so these are the first four up top right over here see one two three four that's from yesterday and then today is one two three four right there right so now we have eight if I move ahead I can see them right there right all right so they're all done so now now I'm ready to go to Twitter the fleets let's go to the fleets so the fleets are very similar to that you just click on the little plus can we see it yeah we see it on the screen as you can see my my tweets my fleets are gone again I don't know why there must be a there must be messed up something so now I just go to gallery I find my as you can see they're there too by the way whenever you're posting to Instagram if you have a Facebook if you tell it to post to your story and to Facebook at the same time it'll end up going to your Facebook page and if you have a Facebook if you don't have a, uh if you have a personal Instagram account you don't need to post on Facebook as well because you can tell it Instagram to post to Facebook at the same time as you me I've got a business account on Instagram so it goes to a Facebook page so it doesn't go to my Facebook profile that's why I upload it as well on my Facebook profile all right but you can see there's two videos of every single one of them this is the same video this one and this one are the same these two are the same and these two are the same and this 50 sec 57 second one is the original snapchat one I did right so I gotta take you know one of these two then one of these two then one of these two and then one of these two right so that's what I do I take this one here and I just click on done and uh whoops let's try something else I'm wondering if uh I guess you can edit the video I haven't tried that yet let's just try that for fun what does it let you oh no this is this is where you're editing it you can change you can change the start the start and end of the video so if you're trying to upload a video that's longer than the 30 the 15 or 20 seconds they allow you would be able to set the start and end and you'd be able to move it along so that you can decide where the video starts where it ends right but in this case I'm just going to say done and then over here as you can see there's no way to add text so this is why I like to do it in Instagram so I can actually have this text right there on the fleet on the story in 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 Twitter right so I tap the fleet and now it's going to post it it's going to say it's uploading and I can do the next one and the cool thing about the fleets is that I can actually do them all right away like this and I can post them all all four of them right away and then when I go back and I look at my fleets well first of all you can see right up here how the little little thing is going around right that's showing you that it's uploading and by the way that's the same on Facebook same on Instagram same on on LinkedIn right so but you see that it's going the next one now right but if I look at here you can see down the bottom it says it's posted next one it says uploading and the other two are saying whoops the other two are saying waiting at the bottom right which is great because that means you can you can post them right away and they'll show up as as it gets there right so that's basically the stories now I'm not sure what's going on because as you uh realize as you know and you can't pause it you can put your finger right on the screen and that'll kind of pause it but you can't pause the uh the video right and uh so I'm not sure if you press the down there oh that lets you delete it if you wanted to delete it but yeah so that's one of the things you can't pause the video like you can do say in TikTok for example and and by the way that's the other thing I do because I record a 60 second video in Snapchat I can actually use that video to upload to TikTok which I actually do so let's go and do it that in TikTok as well so I just go here and I click on the upload and then I choose where's the video right there I gotta go find see these 15 second ones I don't want those right in TikTok I want the original 50 sec 50 second video that I did in Snapchat and by the way this one is another one I did earlier that I, that my computer froze so that's why there's two of them but this one here I just go like this oh and as you can see the fleets in 
Twitter are 30 seconds I thought they were 20 they're actually 30 seconds you see this is the one I recorded earlier just before the beginning of this episode it's actually showing 30 seconds of length so that's cool to know I I re didn't realize it was 30 so that means that in in snapchats you got 10 seconds or really 60 in Instagram you got 15 seconds but you can do four of them so 60 as well in Facebook you can do only 20 seconds at a time same thing with LinkedIn and now in Twitter it's 30 seconds of course they had to do something better right so that's what uh, you get right here if I just click on next I just tap next right here I'm going to say having fun learning Twitter fleets so I'm going to make this like this whoops and I'm going to say set duration I'm going to put that at the beginning right here so I'm just doing this little have you heard have you heard of fleets I'm going to do the same thing here set duration make it show up a little bit after the other one today's today's episode is all about all about Twitter fleets whoops fleets or stories stories there we go let's do that put that up here set duration and show up after this right here do that and then I'm going to post my normal text right here let's do that again like this there we go <clears throat> and this is kind of what I do every day with all my stories right I kind of do that like this and then I add the learn more right here at the end there we go like this and then I usually add some music so let's add some music let's add some music uh let's call it uh, I don't know clubbing <laughs> doesn't really matter uh Sammy Porter what's that whatever it doesn't really matter I'm just just for fun then the volume of course I gotta lower the volume of the music there we go and then there so now I'm posting to my TikTok I select the cover I gotta go in here and I gotta add the text and then I just post that same text here too and then I say learn more as well I basically do the same thing it's I should do better probably but you know um that's basically what I do let's do uh, fleets fleets Twitter oh that's too bad let's get rid of some of these things because I want to include that for sure Twitter and Twitter fleets uh oh let's get the clicky push out of there too then because I want that definitely want that fleets Twitter stories what about Twitter stories Twitter whoops that's not right Twitter stories oh okay well that's good okay let's do that <clears throat> post that and there we go so now we're uploading to TikTok as well yes. <coughs> all right so anyways that's Twitter fleets Twitter stories basically it's it's you know up here right you can see right up here and you can see all these stories you can see who saw your story unfortunately right now I can't show you anymore because it I don't know if that message I got here you can't even I can't even look at it anymore I guess that's one of the things uh, but whatever other fleets that are supposed to still be in my thing uh, maybe you can see them if you were to go to my Twitter account you might I don't know that like I said there's if you google Twitter fleets you're going to see there's people talking about how they had trouble the first couple of days are probably still struggling with some technology technological issues right but still it's pretty cool to see 
a new platform with stories and you can actually leverage that to get more people to see your stuff if you're syndicating I mean like I'm syndicating to 24 platforms and now it's now I'm syndicating to six six different story platforms right there's snapchat stories there's Instagram stories there's Facebook stories there's Facebook messenger stories there's LinkedIn stories and now there is a fleets Twitter stories so if you uh if you want to syndicate your content you want to figure out a way to do it really quick I've got um webinar I'm doing every Tuesday you should go check that out you can find it on my blog obviously and uh, we'll see you in the next episode have yourself a great day this has been Course Income Secrets, the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom. Some of your friends need to hear this message, so don't forget to share. For more content like this, go to CourseIncomeSecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here. My name is Jean-Serge Gagnon. Until next time.